uh, at www. Um, noblegoldinvestment.com that's www.noblegoldinvestment.com we are at war and we are in recession and two things the government doesn't want you to know but it's only a matter of time until cracks start to show do you know who will get hit the most you that's right that's why you need to protect yourself and your family because the things will get worse fortunately noblegoldinvestment.com is here to help you You've, uh, you've worked too hard, folks, to build up your savings, your investments, to see it all just crash to bits in a financial fallout from the wars, the trade tariffs, the sanctions that are bound to happen. Gold and silver from noblegoldinvestments.com are real possessions in times like these. Knowing that you're outside the system when it all goes wrong is a good feeling. Matter of fact, a surefire way to keep your money safe for your retirement is to have uh, your 401, especially your 401k, have it in precious metals IRA. Noble Gold Investments will help, has helped many people like you to keep their money safe for years on end. The, this month, they're even giving away this beautiful Gold Eagle American Bullion Coin, the American Gold Eagle Coin, with every qualifying IRA $50,000 or higher. Don't get trampled, don't get left behind. Uh, go to www.noblegoldinvestment.com. That's www.noblegoldinvestment.com. Or pick up the phone and call them right now at 877-646-5347. That's 877-646-5347. And tell them that Pastor Paul Begley sent you. Or click on the link below. All right. A confirmed administration official stated on Sunday that President Biden is expected to announce a ban on oil and gas leasing in the Arctic Ocean across all U.S. territories. According to an administration official, President Biden is set to make an announcement on Monday during his trip to California that he intends to prohibit oil and gas leasing across the entire U.S. territory in the Arctic Ocean, CBS News reported. Now, the official also stated that the president's trip will include Include a discussion on AUKUS, the nuclear submarine partnership between the U.S., U.K., and Australia in San Diego, and a discussion on gun violence in Monterey Park, where 11 people were shot and killed at a dance studio earlier this year. According to the administration official, the Biden administration will reveal its intentions to protect over 13 million acres of land in the National Petroleum Reserve in Alaska from oil and gas leasing as part of the president's announcement to ban Arctic drilling. What exactly is coming our way? How can we prepare? And what does the Bible say about it? Find out the answers in Deep Impact, Planet X, and Incoming Asteroids. Get critical updates from these experts. Pastor Begley provides biblical relevance, and Bart Begley presents another amazing documentary. The Deep Impact Planet X and Incoming Asteroids DVD set. Available now at paulbegleyprophecy.com. According to state media reports, Iran has completed negotiations to produce a Soki Su-35 fighter jet from Russia, indicating a strengthening of defense collaboration between the two nations. Iran's Air Force, which has been impacted by economic sanctions, possesses an outdated fleet of planes and has encountered difficulties in obtaining replacement components to maintain its military aircraft, Breitbart News reported. Now, in a communication to the United Nations, Tehran stated that it commenced reaching out to various nations to purchase fighter jets in order to replenish its aircraft fleet after the conclusion of the Iran-Iraq War, which took place from 1980 to 1988. Now, according to a statement published by the official IRNA news agency on Friday, Russia expressed its readiness to sell fighter jets to Iran after the expiry of restrictions on Iran purchasing conventional weapons under UN Resolution 2231 in October of 2020. The statement also mentioned that Iran had been approaching different countries to buy fighter jets in order to replenish its aging fleet of aircraft. 
The world economy, the 2030 global agenda, the emergence of a new world order. What's the European organization CERN discovering about how the universe works? Experts explain in the Concerned Webinar DVD from Paul Begley Prophecy Ministries. Pastor Paul Begley teaches what the Bible says about these apocalyptic events, and Bart Begley presents another thought-provoking documentary. The Concerned Webinar DVD, available at paulbegleyprophecy.com. Authorities reported on Sunday that rebels in eastern Congo had killed a minimum of 19 people and set ablaze a health center and several homes. Carly Nanzu, the ex-governor of North Kivu province, stated in an interview with state media that armed individuals believed to be members of the Allied Democratic Forces, or the ADF militia, that has connections to the Islamic State group, assaulted civilians in Kernerdra, town, the Associated Press reported. Now, in the past few days, the ADF assaults have claimed the lives of numerous individuals in multiple North Kivu villages. This is according to Congo's authorities. The victims were brutally attacked using guns, knives, and machetes. On Saturday, Amok, a news agency affiliated with the Islamic State group, released a statement in which Islamic State claimed accountability for the death of over 35 Christians and the injuring of several others in eastern Congo the previous week. Now, for several decades, there have been a simmering conflict in eastern Congo, with over 120 armed groups fighting for control, authority, and resources with some aiming to safeguard their communities. The ADF has mainly been active in North Kivu province, but it has recently expanded its activities into the adjacent Itiri province.